family he says he fought hard at the gym. It's just not the same. He loved boxing. He loved the sport of boxing, but he loved his family more. Coach David Hernandez has been training John Dwayne Van Meter here for nine years. He was your modern day Rocky Balboa boy. That boy keep fight. He packed the punch. But the boxer and father of two will never fight again. You know, no one never plans to bury their son. The 24 year old was shot and killed. According to police, a woman called saying someone had broken into the home and shot John. No word on what led up to the shooting or the motive. Police say a 12 year old is responsible. John's fiance tells Kins 5 John used to train the suspected killer. I just hope they, they got the right person because nobody's life should be taken. John's father was proud of him. He missed his last fight. I wasn't able to make that fight, but I'm able to keep these gloves in memory of my son. His coach says John put Uvalde on the map and opened the doors for other young aspiring boxers. But all I can say is, John, we miss you, man. We love you. We always will love you. Your locker, when <clears throat> nobody would ever use your locker again. That's yours until I die. I love you, dog. <laughs> was supposed to be at the end of February. Funeral services for Van Meter are pending and are being held at Hellcrest Memorial Funeral in Uvalde. Jeff? Henry, thank you for that update. The 12-year-old suspect attended school in the Uvalde CISD. And district spokesmen tell us tonight, quote, these types of incidents have a ripple effect on our schools and we will continue to provide counseling services at all campuses, end quote. Now, our coverage of this story continues right now at Kins5.com and the Kins5 app. You can look there for updates as soon as we have them in our newsroom.